Soundcore is sponsoring this video and sent over this, the Boom 2, and I've never had a speaker that I can do this with. In the last few videos, I've been talking about gearing up for spring and summer and getting some products that will help with, you know, getting outside, having fun, and just not having to deal with winter anymore. And well, this, the Soundcore Boom 2, is another one of those products to add to the list. Now, Soundcore has been making, you know, speakers and Bluetooth speakers for years at this point. In fact, I've talked about some of them here on the channel before. And the Boom 2 is the uh, upgrade, or I guess next generation of the Motion Boom, so just a slightly different name here. But this, I think, is the best lifestyle speaker you can get, at least the best that you can get that has a subwoofer built in, especially for under, well under $200. There's absolutely tons of speakers on the market and some of them are really good, but when you get to that lower end or the more affordable end of the spectrum, a lot of times the first thing to go to cut both size and just, you know, cost is that subwoofer. So you get a, you know, decently scenic experience, but it's not what it could be. The Boom 2 kind of melds that together. So you still get a subwoofer, you get all the portability and usability. And I think this is a good one to add to the list. Now sound quality, of course, very important for a speaker, but I think what at least caught my eye initially about the Boom 2 is the form factor and the you know hardware of it, because this is packing a lot of pretty neat features that especially if you're going outdoors, if you're you know going to the beach, something like that, this thing is kind of the one you want to have. And really for me, the thing I like about this is that it is IPX7 waterproof and it floats. So if you're gonna be doing any kind of water activities, you're gonna be by the pool, you're going to the lake or something people here where I live love to do is, you know, float down the river. This is the one you want because, you know, if something happens, it gets wet, starts raining, you drop it in the water. You're not gonna really have any issues there. And I know for me, given that, you know, this is my job, this is what I do, I get a lot of cool products and people always want me to bring the cool stuff to the party or the, you know, adventure we're doing. And this one is going to be what I start taking with me, especially if water is involved. And aside from that, I think this just has a really fun design. So it's got a handle, so it's easy to carry around. It's super lightweight, it doesn't really weigh much at all. And on the sides of the speaker, you get LEDs, so you can kind of have this light show effect for the music that you are playing. Now this connects to the Anchor Soundcore app. So in here, you can change a bunch of things like the equalizer, which I'll talk about again in a second, but also you can change the color of the lights here and you know change kind of the effects that it does so that you can just have whatever lighting you like. Now this LED area is not just for lighting. This is where we start talking about sound quality because these are also passive radiators for the subwoofer. And when you're playing music, this really vibrates and you can see it putting in work. But this speaker is a 2.1 channel speaker. So that means there are two tweeters and then you get the one subwoofer. And this is a 60 watt system. So the sub is 40 watts and then you get two 10 watt tweeters, but that could be bumped up to 80 watts if you want to have the maximum sound quality possible. And that'll go up to 99.5 decibels, which is pretty loud. And this can easily fill a room or fill a campsite or wherever you're using it. This thing packs a punch. Now to get that 80 watts, you're going to hit the bass up button. And this basically just takes the bass to the next level because, you know, when it's off, it's still, it's pretty good. But when you click it on, there is a noticeable difference. And really there's only one way to show that. And that's by, you know, showing it here in the video. So I'll do a quick sound test. Obviously this is not gonna be what it sounds like in person, but you can at least get an idea of what the sound difference is. Okay, so I'm playing a song here with the bass up on, and you can see once it gets to the bass here that yeah, it's pumping, and this is, it, it has a lot of power behind it, I and mean, you can just see it from those passive radiators, and you actually feel it while you listen. So I'll give you a little second here. Okay, and now I'll turn bass up off, and on video, it is not the most impressive difference, but in person, you can actually feel the difference with the bass. There's still bass there, but if you turn it back on, I mean, it is a noticeable difference. 
So yeah, the bass up button really does change the way this sounds. And this is using bass up 2.0 technology. They've had bass up before, but it's kind of like the next step in that. It's not just an equalizer, although that is something you can do. This is actually giving you more output. Now, the downside of that is that this will give you slightly less battery life, but if you're someone that really likes that bass sound, I think it's worth it. And if you don't like the way this sounds out of the box, if you go into the Soundcore app, you can adjust the equalizer settings. Soundcore has a few different ones on their own, or you can go in there and just tweak it to make it sound exactly how you want. So from a sound quality perspective, you are getting great you know, speaker hardware that gives you clear and crisp audio that also gets really loud and really powerful. So it, it, it checks off the boxes there. Now, another area this comes in handy is with battery life. So this has 24 hours of battery life if you're playing at like mid volume. So that's pretty great. That's a long time. But one thing I really like is that this can actually act as a power bank. So if you know, you're out camping and your phone starts to die, you could sacrifice the speaker's battery so that you can, you know, keep the, I guess, more important things charged up. It's just a nice little thing to at least be able to do if you ever needed it. So, I mean, yeah, for every category that you look at, the Boom 2 is kind of delivering. And for $130, I mean, well under $200, this kind of gives you everything. You get a great speaker system that has a subwoofer built in. You get waterproof and even floating ability. And I think the design, you know, looks pretty great as well with great battery life. So it's kind of, it's kind of got everything. So if you want to check this out, you know, get ready for that spring summer adventure, check out the link down in the description where you can learn more about this and pick one up for yourself. But yeah, I mean, I think having a good speaker that you can take with you anywhere is important. And this one just might be the one.